Hey, Steve Taylor here, giving you a look at the Infic, which I guess is how you pronounce it, wireless mouse. It is a unique mouse. Um, it was made available to me, and I just said, you know what, that is just really cool looking. So I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. And, well, it kind of looks like a Ferrari, and it kind of looks like a big ant or some sort of an insect. But it is kind of unique, and it's pretty comfortable. Um, I'm not sure how this looks on the camera, but it is a very, very, very candy apple red color. You have your DPI switch here for changing, I think it's, uh, I forgot now, 1,000, 1,200, and 1,600 DPI, something like that. Uh, you can almost not tell the difference between them, but 1600 is perfectly fine setting. You have your scroll wheel here, and uh, it also is a button, so it can be programmed as a button and this. You have your left and right. These do not do anything on the side. They are not extra buttons. This is not a gaming mouse. This is just comfortable. So your your hand sits on this here, and then you have this. And it it is it is comfortable. I wouldn't say it's like, in the category of an ergonomic mouse, uh, but it is a uh, it is a comfortable mouse, standard mouse that doesn't look like a standard mouse. So you will definitely get uh, get people going, "What in the world is that?" But really, it operates and feels pretty much like a regular mouse. That's um, uh, wireless, as I said. You get the little um, receiver thing that goes into your USB. Comes with a little charging cable. So uh, you basically plug it in the front port right here and then you charge it up and it's good to go for a good amount of time. The uh, base is metal, as you can see, which I like because the firmness of it and part of me, it has these little silicone type pads right here and they're very, they're really barely there. And so uh, if you get a nice desk, you might want to put something down because metal scratches a lot more than say a plastic mouse would. So that is really my only concern with a mouse at all is the metal uh, scratching something. So be aware of that. You get an on-off switch here and then here's your laser right here. So uh, small enough for a kid's hand, but definitely large enough for an adult's hand. I don't have a huge hand. I'm kind of like a medium sized glove. So uh, if you have really large hands, you may find this to be a little bit too small. Uh, at work, I use a uh, Logitech Trackman where you rest your hand and you only use your thumb and then your buttons are here to sort of move around here. And I'm addicted to those. So I mean, I use that most most often, but for home use and uh, with a laptop so you don't have to use that stupid pad in the middle. This is a great little mouse and it does look really cool and I'm impressed with it. So except for the metal, which isn't necessarily a negative, um, I think it's a five-star mouse. So Hopefully you found this review helpful. I'm Steve Taylor for Amazon.com.